Hello everybody, welcome back to the Hacienda Ribbit here. Today we're going to make something fantastic. A Sicilian uh, chicken cacciatore sandwich and even better. This is going to be a collaboration with Sal over at the Root Boy Cooks. Uh, he's making one too and our sandwiches are going up head to head. So um, I'm going to put a link up here in the upper right hand corner on the iCards to his channel also in the notes below so go over to his uh, website YouTube site uh, give him some love tell him the rivet sent you and check out his sandwich I am sure it's gonna be something fantastic because he is always throwing down some serious food on his uh, smokers and grills so a uh, couple items here to start with uh, I'm not gonna bore you with all the ingredients the ingredients will be in the list down below um, we've got Sicilian Nero Davola, uh, the best known wine of Sicily. It is a worldwide favorite. It is just absolutely rich, luscious, fantastic, full of body and berry flavor. Uh, we've also got a Pan Toscano uh, from our local bakery, uh, which we're going to use to make the sandwich. And this, the Pies de Resistance Ricotta Salata. I don't know if you remember from my previous uh, Sicilian videos, I was moaning the fact that I couldn't find this anywhere in town. I turned town inside out, couldn't find it. The only place I could find it was online, and it was ridiculously expensive. Uh, the shipping was even more expensive than the cheese itself. So the other day, I'm going to the wine store to pick up this wine here, and uh, it's the International Wine Center here in town and uh, they have a real small deli tucked away in the corner so just out of the happenstance I went over there and said hey you guys got ricotta salata he said sure here and uh, he gave me that they carry it there regularly so there you go we got ricotta salata so let's go ahead oh let me tell you a little bit about um, chicken cacciatore uh, that means in Italian it means hunter's chicken and uh, it's a very very simple dish uh, very rustic. Uh, the hunter went out hunting to help put some protein on the table and whatever he brought back that's what went in the recipe. Uh, rabbit, uh, quail, uh, probably not chickens, they're not running loose, but you get the idea. Um, and as he was foraging through the the woods and and the fields if he ran across you know onions or Wild peppers anything that he could find that was good mushrooms. Pff, it's going in the uh, recipe So let's go ahead and get started We got a large frying pan with some uh, olive oil and now we've got some generously salted and peppered boneless skinless chicken thighs and we're gonna go ahead and uh, brown them Now, once they're browned like this on both sides, we're going to take them off and set them off to the side. All right, now over medium heat, in the same oil we cooked the chicken, we're going to add the uh, cheater's garlic. Okay. And I found half a tomato in the fridge, so I chopped that up, and we're going to add that in there too. Now, we're going to uh, sweat out the garlic for a moment. Okay, the uh, garlic's getting nicely aromatic now. So we're going to add the onions, bell peppers, and uh, make that tasty. And to that, we're going to add uh, two cans of this Contadina tomato paste. Each one is six ounces. Right, so now we've got the tomato paste um, all mixed in as well as we can. We're going to add about a cup, cup and a half of the uh, Nero de Avola. A little bit more. Okay, and we'll stir that in. Okay, and as good as that smells, wow, I know uh, Sal's chicken cacciatore is probably smelling even better. Don't forget to go to his uh, channel, check him out. Now we're going to add two cups of uh, better than bouillon uh, beef stock. There's one right now, I'll add the second in a moment. Alright, next up are the, uh, oh, a generous tablespoon of red pepper flakes. About a half cup of coarsely chopped black olives. About a half cup of um, 
porcini mushrooms. I bought those uh, dehydrated and reconstituted them. We got a tablespoon basil and a teaspoon of uh, oregano and a couple sprigs of uh, rosemary. Now we're going to incorporate that really nicely and join me in a bit. Okay, that's bubbling real nicely. So uh, now we're going to nestle in the chicken and get it submerged in there. And uh, we're going to let it simmer like this, oh, for about 45 minutes to an hour uh, until the chicken is done. So join me then. All right, it has been one hour. The chicken is done. Everything is delicious. Let's make a sandwich. All right, let's put the sandwich together. We've got this end off the pane toscano uh, cut out, and then we dug out the, uh, the innards, and that's going to make a little pocket for our chicken. So let's go ahead and put that in there. Oh, so we got a chicken thigh in there, and now we want some plenty of this good sauce. Ooh. Oh, yes and the vegetation and the olives and the onions and all that good stuff look at that oops I'm making a mess here oh my goodness and of course you're gonna need some of this uh, ricotta salata to garnish it on top and there's your beautiful Sicilian chicken cacciatore sandwich now that's not all people and look how easy it is to hold that is a meal right there now we're gonna have to quaff the froth we got some Italian beer okay so what we have here is a delicious Italian birra moretti uh, l'autentica the recetta del 1859 all right, so this is made with the original recipe from 1859. Um, this is a lager, uh, so let's go ahead and uh, open it up. Now we got the uh, frosty rivet mug here, and let's go ahead and pour it. All right, looks good nice head let's give it a sniff oh yeah oh you can taste smell the hops and the uh, the beer let's taste it mmm that is crisp and refreshing definitely a lager a healthy lager with a nice hoppy bite at the end. Wow. Hey Sal, you would love this beer. This has a buttload of hops in it. Mm -mm -mm. Oh yeah. Perfect. Birra Moretti. Definitely buy that one again. All right, people. Thanks for watching. Go check out Sal Sandwich. This is a collaboration with the Root Boy Cooks. Thanks for watching, people. Welcome to Sicily.